Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Tonight we're going to be adding lights to the uh, country store. We're going to put four lights in it. I'm going to do two up here. Now I'll get to those in a second. But there's going to be one right here. There's going to be one right here. And the two up front, there's going to be one underneath this. And one right here. And I'll light up the sign. So that will go up like that. For these little 0402s. I mean, these things are tiny. <laughs> I'd like to thank all the uh, new subscribers. Uh, I've been getting a lot lately. So I hope that you guys are enjoying what I'm doing. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying doing these videos for you. It's about, oh, I think when I checked last, is probably about 33 degrees outside. Now, my shop is not insulated. I don't have any heat. I have a heat lamp that we use for chickens um, underneath my bench right now. So, it's pretty cold in here. Someday I would like to enclose a, a a little room inside my shop. I mean, it's a fairly large shed, and I can sacrifice a, a, a 16 by 12 spot just for, you know, enclose it and, and still have plenty of room. All right. If you like what you see, if you like these videos, hit that subscribe button for me. Give me a like and hit the notification bell. I got a couple other things coming up. I went and visited a, uh, took my son down to a uh, train, a, a model shop today. And I picked up a, a few things. So I'll definitely be uh, posting those builds up. Let's get started. All right, it's getting pretty cold in here. I actually had to go inside the house to uh, let this glue dry. Um, no, it's just this uh, rapid fuse, but sets in 30 seconds. See, not in this weather. It's usually not this cold this time of year. I mean, it, it gets cold, but you know, it's fairly tolerable here in Pennsylvania. But let's finish this up. Thank you. 
All right, here we go. It's all lit up. I still got to put a little, um, little piece of plastic or something here. I paint it black so it shines the, uh, so we don't see the light. So it's just eliminating the sign. No, something like that. It got pretty cold in here last night, so I had to record this uh, this little clip here this morning. But I got the light underneath there. I think that turned out pretty neat. This one worked out pretty good. Like I said, I'll put a little dome over top of this, so you know it'll just light up on the uh, sign and down on the street. This one, I might have a little short or a bad LED. I tested them all um, and before I put them in, and it, it was working, but you can see it's uh, dimmed a little bit there. So, I might have messed around with it too much, waiting for that glue to dry. So, I'll have to replace that. But overall, I'm happy with it. And the placement on his layout is going to be uh, on the opposite side of the road from the track. So we're, I'm not going to do any, the track's not going to run across the back. And we'll just use it as like a loading dock for trucks or something. So we'll be able to see the front of this at all times. Yeah, I'm happy with it. If you like this video, Leave a comment down below, subscribe for me, hit that like button, hit the notification button for me. I got a bunch more videos like this coming out, and uh, like I said I got my bridges to do therein. So, yeah. Have a good one.